here in the garage. As usual, not a scrub, please scrub below. I'll we'll do kind of translate some rhythms of songs, 90s, early 2000s, somewhere around there. Uh, as usual, uh, standard tune today. E A D G B E. We all know this, should know this by now. Uh, anyways, uh, I'm gonna I'm using my Mojo Mojo pedal, obviously for the uh, chorus part. Uh, kick it up. You can play this on acoustic. You can do it however you want. This is just kind of uh, the way I kind of hear. It. Anyways. Uh, we'll start off with that little op uh, opening, the uh, verse part that plays over and over throughout the song. Uh, we're going to start off here on the second of the G, and we're going to want to play the D and the G only, so. And then with a kind of, I down strum that. And then on my up, try to pick this open bottom E. And we're going to be on three of the B, and we're going to want to try to play this time the G and the B only. It's all together. Then the toughest part kind of of this rundown, we're gonna to wanna to go back up to this open G to five on the E, open E, three on the B, open. So. And then he comes back around uh, you play, uh, most of the parts are he plays that twice around, and then the third time around, you just start with. And then you'll end right there and go back up to your top, so all together kind of. you through that whole part. Uh, next I'm going to kick on my overdrive pedal. Um, like I said, you can play this however you want. Uh, the chorus goes two different ways. I'll show you the chorus, the first chorus, and then the second one that leads up into the solo. So if you're playing along with the song, this should get you all the way up into the solo. And like I always talk about, we're just one man here, so we just like playing these parts of it. So anyways, you're going to start off here on the three, the E, five of the A and the D. Run down on the top A string, we're gonna go from three, five, seven, back to five, and then open on the A. So do that twice, and then we're gonna slide down here to the seven of the E, nine of the A and the D. Now this rundown is going to be from 7 of the A to 9 of the A, then to 7 of the D, back to 9 of the A, and then 7 of the A. Now for the first chorus, he goes back up to this part. Follows that where we're gonna be on five of the E and then seven of the A and the D and just strum that out. And if you're playing with an overdrive pedal, obviously kick that off in the erector. Back to your opening. Uh, the second time through going into the uh, actual <clears throat> what I want to say, into the solo, he'll just do the first part and come into the second part and go for it right from the second part back up to here to the so and then the solo kicks in so that should be all the parts like i said leading up to that uh fun song to play uh especially if you got a distortion or overdrive pedal uh and you can screw around with it you can also do it what you can do is crank up if you got obviously a solid state amp you want to crank it up uh, pretty high and then just control it by the volume of your guitar take the volume down when you're doing the opening parts and Then when you want to kick it in crank your volume all the way up and that should obviously give you a lot more gain uh, Anyways uh, As usual any questions any comments down below just usually like we talk about doing the rhythms of the songs any suggestions come on guys Just me coming up with a lot of these so it's up to you if you want to hear something a little bit different or if there's something out there that you don't have so uh, as usual have fun here in the garage.